Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I will be doing my third hair update since I shaved my hair. I shaved it in June 2014, so that's just over two years now. Pretty scary to think that this is me almost two years ago. Yep. Shaved all my head off. So the reason why I shaved my hair and I get a lot of questions is mainly because my hair was absolutely fried. I used to have a really short pixie cut and I had um, an undercut so it was shaved all the way underneath. I basically just wanted my hair to grow out all at the same length and be nice and healthy again. I used to be like a white bleach blonde so I would do my roots myself and I would do it every three weeks so you could imagine the amount of damage to my hair and I would also constantly change color like pink, purple, blue, green, orange, red, whatever color I felt like that week I would change my hair and then to start fresh I would do a bleach bath so that was also really really damaging on my hair so I'm really really glad that I did shave my hair off but I'm also really happy that I now have hair because it does go through that really really awkward phase and I'm sorry guys you just have to go through that awkward phase where your hair is all like spiky and looking really weird. For me to get through that awkward phase I did wear wigs. Most of you guys asked where I buy my wigs. I brought them online, I looked on eBay, I brought them at specialty wig stores which is, they're a little bit more expensive there because they are for people who want their wigs to look quite natural. I don't have any human hair wigs though, they're about $300. The only wigs that I used were either a mix or just 100% synthetic. Uh, but they did look quite real. A trick that I used to do is put baby powder into the wig if it was 100% synthetic and that way it didn't look as shiny and as fake. So this is my hair growth at the moment. All I do to my hair, and I actually need my hair done really soon, a hairdresser does balayage. So he concentrates on the ends of the hair and kind of jaggers it up towards the root. We've never gone right onto the root because that's where it causes damage and that's where your hair can potentially snap off and break. I'll show you from the back how long it is now for those of you that have been um, kind of watching me from the start. If you're interested in looking at my shaving my hair off video when I first put in tape hair extensions which was about a year shorter than that sorry it was maybe like mu nine months in. I forgot where I was at because my memory card got full. Anyway, so I'm going to show you the back of my hair for those of you that are interested. That's, oh, I can't quite grab it yet, <laughs> but that's how long it is now. So it definitely, it's continued to grow. The health of it is really good. The only bad thing is when you're growing your hair out, because your hair grows in all one length, it tends to get a little bit mullet looking. So you do need to get regular haircuts so that your hair can grow at the one length. Or if you like that layered look, then like I do, I like to have some layers, then you can just get some layers cut in. But yeah, I'll give you a closer look. So uh, this is the color of it at the moment. It does need to be done, which is why there are some lighter bits and some kind of like orangey bits. And then of course I've got my natural hair color, but it is looking much healthier. Can you guys hear that car alarm going off in the background? Sorry about that. Much healthier and this is actually the longest that my hair has been in like six years. Um, and my fringe is so, so long right now too. <laughs> so yeah, that's good. And my hair is always more kind of like thick and chunky on this side just because of the way I part my hair. So if I was to part my hair completely like dead middle part, then it wouldn't be kind of thicker on this side. The amount of hair would be evened out more. So a lot of you guys in the comments also ask me if I would ever do this again. My answer would have to be no. Look, 
I did enjoy it when I did it. It was really fun. And of course, watching it grow is, you know, quite an exciting thing, but I don't think I would do it again. I can't wait for my hair to be really long and mermaid-like again. So I guess that's what my goal is at the moment. And so now what I'm gonna do is I'm just going to insert some photos so that you can see the gradual progress of how my hair grew out. So basically from bald the first day that I did it up until now. I don't wanna hurt you, but I'm about to work you, watch your mouth drop real loud. I'm turning you up and burning the clutch, full speed, both feet to the floor, feet to the floor. DJ running that back once more. Time to party, that's all I know. Grab somebody, tell them baby, baby. So I got, hope you guys enjoyed that. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you to all of my subscribers. If you are new to my channel, please subscribe. I will be bringing out more regular videos, I promise. If you have any requests, any questions or anything like that, I will reply. So please comment down below there for me. And thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys have a great week. Bye.